What's up, YouTube? It's Destruction back with another box openings. Well, actually, two box openings. So these are my last two Raging Tempest boxes. Uh, I don't know when I'm going to be getting any more boxes for a while. So yeah, let's. Hopefully, these will count, and uh, hopefully, we get some sick pulls. All right, let's get this started. All right. So I'm really looking for Barrage. Obviously, everybody's looking for Barrage, but it'll be my playset. So that'd be sick if I pulled one. If you guys haven't already checked it out, check out my Fusion Enforcer box openings. Holy crap, I had some great pulls in there. Probably the best three boxes of Fusion Enforcer you can ask for, honestly. Um, yeah, so like that was a really dope uh, opening, so you guys should definitely check it out if you haven't. Tell your friends about it, because yeah, it was sick. So let's see what we get in these packs. We have a Fusion Recycling Plant and Cyber Angel Natasha for our super. I'm going to try to get through these kind of quick. I, I barely slept and I have to go to work soon, so. Yeah, I was too excited last night opening five boxes of this, and then I knew my Fusion Enforcers were coming today, so, yeah. I was, I was pretty excited all night, so it was kind of hard to see. <laughs> like an old kid, I guess. Wind Witch Crystal Bell, and a Whip Tail. Yeah, man, the company I ordered this from was really dope. Um... I got Fusion Enforcer like two or three days early. I was really surprised. I was expecting not to be able to get them until like Monday because I know they released Friday and I figure, um, so we have a Christian Quarry on. I figured that I, I wouldn't get them until after the weekend. So yeah, I was really happy when I got notified that I was gonna be getting the package today. So yeah, I'm very happy about that. And the pools were, like I said, they were just sick. So makes me even more happy. Flower Cardian, Light Flare, and a True King. Yeah, I'm sorry if this is going fast. Uh, I've already opened so many boxes of this, and everybody's already seen plenty of these videos, I'm sure, so we'll just try to get to the uh, the rares and foils as, as fast as possible. Alright, we have a Zodiac Borbo and a Subterra Behemoth. Hopefully, um, my phone doesn't fill up again. It interrupted like three times during my last video, so hopefully that's not the case this time. There's Shino Bird Peacock and that grass looks greener. Okay, it's not the worst. Uh, I actually pulled, spoiler uh, alert, I pulled a playset last night, so there's a fourth one, so I guess it's a uh, trade for trade there. I really want to pull a Dryden. I mean, obviously, I want to get um, the Barrage, but. I haven't pulled the Dryden yet, so I need two Dryden, uh, one more Bullhorn, and uh, one more Barrage. Spiritual Beast Team, and Sulfonair. And I pretty much pulled all the Wind Witches that I need. Um, I still kind of want to finish out the playsets of each one of them because I'm only going to be running like 3 2 one uh, ratio and I just want for collection purposes okay here's a glass bow awesome <laughs> um, I think she's the one I only had two of so that's sick but yeah for collection purposes I want to finish out the playset of each of them so I need I need that and then I need I think it was snow uh, snowbell or snowball I don't know but yeah the orb looking one is the one I need we have a whip tail I have a giant pile of wrappers from uh, my Fusion Enforcer and then working on making it bigger with this set. This one. All right, Ancient Gear Reborn and Sulfonair. That's crazy, I, I, I feel like I only pulled like two or three of him last night out of five boxes and I've already gotten two of them from this. I mean, I guess it's just really random or whatever, but yeah, it's pretty crazy. Yeah, I added on two more Fusion Enforcer boxes at the last second because they they called me to let me know that my boxes are going to be arriving today, which was uh, these two Raging Tempest and Sea Monsters, Sea Monster Theseus. All right, uh, not the greatest holes for this box for Super Far Secret Rares. But yeah, they uh, they notified me yesterday saying that my package is going to be delivered today. I was like, Jesus, it's pretty freaking early con considering it doesn't come out till Friday. So I was like. I asked them if I added on if they'd be able to send the rest of my package out with them. Or, yeah, the new package with this one. And they were like, yeah, we could do that. So, 
I was like, alright, I'll add two more. And yeah, I was, I'm pretty happy that I did because the pulls were great, like I said. Super Heavy Samurai, Spiral Beer. Formal Pound Laugh. Zodiac Thoroughblade. Okay, sick. So I only pulled one last night. Out of three boxes, I pulled one Thoroughblade. Well, that's pretty crazy. So there's my second one. So I'm very happy about that. So I don't have to try to trade for one. I know everybody's trying to get their Zodiacs from everybody. But also, it's been opened up a, a, a shit ton. So it's probably not that hard to get what we need. Besides the uh, secrets, of course. We have a tier. But yeah, so... I, I don't think I'll be running more than two. So yeah, two's perfect number for me. Chaos Ancient Gear. Yeah, so I, I pulled a playset of the Grass of Greener and um, the Virus card, which I wasn't very happy about getting the three of the Virus. But I mean, I guess it's better than getting that. Uh, I forget what it is. It's, it's the Fusion Dragon, not DCS, the other one. It's better than getting that, I suppose. We have a Switcher Roru and Neo Galaxy Cypher Dragon. So I think we're still looking for two more Ultra Rare, if I'm not mistaken. I think we've only pulled two so far. Try to focus so far. Our uh, Heavy Armor Train. Spiral Tough is rare and Wind Witch Nobel. Okay, so there, I have a play set of every <laughs> Wind Witch now, so that's pretty sick. It only took six boxes, but that's fine. So I do need one more Thoroughblade to make it a play set. Uh, I wouldn't mind just for collection purposes, but okay, we have a wrap here. But uh, I don't, I'm not hurting for one. So. I think that's our first rat. That's crazy. One rat. Well, I don't know. I guess it's not that crazy. I feel like you should pull multiples off. So we have a Samurai and Subterra Cave Flash. Alright, last pack for our first box. And then we got one more box to do, guys. Man, it felt like Christmas this past few days. Just opening a crazy amount of boxes. That's absurd. Alright, Neo Galaxy for our last one. Alright, what are... Uh, one, two, three, okay, four. I guess they weren't that exciting, so that's why I didn't uh, remember what I pulled. Alright, can we get a barrage? Barrage or Dryden? I mean, another bullhorn is fine too. Whatever, I need I need my secret rares for ZDX, man. I guess I can run the Wind Witches for now, though. Because uh, I'm pretty positive I have everything I need for that now. So That's pretty crazy. Out of three boxes, I pretty much pulled all the stuff to make Eidolon Wind Witches or whatever. So, yeah, spoiler. We have a whip tail for our first pack. So, yeah, I'll probably be playing that this weekend at the um, at my locals. I just got to get it together and practice it. Because, honestly, I haven't, I haven't been practicing with Zodiacs much or Wind Witches. Um, on YGO Dev Pro or whatever, which I, I really should have been. I've been more like looking into buying cards and trying to get good deals on eBay. Yeah, but my friend actually leaked because I've I never really used eBay before. I mean, not that I've never used it, I just don't really shop on there. But my friend linked me to a, it's a one dollar, um, whip whiptail for our superhero. It was a one dollar, um, what is it called? Cards. Uh, oh my goodness, I'm drawing a blank. It's the one where you draw up to three cards, and then you have to discard your whole hand. And you can't special summon. Uh, I, I'm drawing a blank here. But I, I own like three of them already. I'll, uh, if I remember it, I'll, I'll mention it. Sorry, I gotta interrupt my video. Oh yeah, card of demise. That's what it was. So it was like one dollar card of demise, one dollar shipping. It was like, dude, that seems way too shady. <laughs> but I was like, it's only two dollars. Like, what's the worst? Like. 
losing two dollars isn't that big of a deal so I figured I'd give it a shot so I'm waiting for that to come in and then after that I've just been hooked on you know going on there and trying to find some deals or whatever so. I found a couple good deals not like like a dollar for an eighteen dollar card or whatever or however much cards of demise is worth but um they have a Windwitch Snowbell for Ultra but yeah, I did find a couple pretty sweet deals. So. I got a pretty cheap um, Cyframe Lord Omega, which the guy only sent it in a soft sleeve in a really thin, flimsy envelope. So I was that was kind of scary, but I mean, it was still in like perfect condition. So luckily it didn't get bent up or anything. And then I got a, a Daigoso Emerald for pretty cheap. I think I paid for like 15 pounds, or not 15 pounds, $15. It might have been pounds, I don't know. But yeah, that's pretty cheap too. So I have a Sulfoner for a Super. Man, I'm just slinging these cards all over the place. It doesn't look like I'm going to be able to get any rest before work today because between this and uploading my Fusion Enforcer video, which is working on right now, and then I have to upload this still. I might actually upload this later. But, uh,. Yeah, I'm definitely not gonna be get any work, or get any rest before work today. It's unfortunate. All right, so we're still uh, looking for two more uh, two secret rares for this box. Uh, Sulfurner again. That's insane. I pulled two or three out of five boxes yesterday, and I pulled four out of um, just the two here. I wonder if like the ratios for European boxes are different than. American because the ones I pulled last night were all American boxes and uh, I don't know like my European fusion of horses were insane so I wonder if that's a thing I'm sure it's probably just all random but flower cardian Zodiac Barrage hell yeah Sweet, sweet, sweet. Okay, so once my one comes in that I ordered, I have a playset. Oh, that's so dope. Alright, I really want to pull a Dryden or a Broad Bull, whatever his name is. Oh, hell yeah, dude, that's sick. That is sick. So that's two that we pulled out of seven boxes. So. Spiral Gear. Alright, so making obviously I could have bought the deck for way cheaper than I bought all these boxes it obviously wouldn't have been quite as exciting um, hell yeah Dryden baby that's what I'm talking about this is the dopest box ever holy crap alright I love Yu-Gi-Oh that's so sick yeah man European boxes that's where it's at screw screw American boxes oh that's so dope but um yeah I can Making Zodiac seems a lot more feasible now, so I need one more Dryden and one more Broad Bull, so that's not bad. That's not bad at all. I'm selling some Magic the Gathering cards on uh, eBay, so hopefully those will sell soon, and I'll just order the last two cards that I need. Oh, that's so sick. Whoops. I'm so excited I'm starting to mix in the foils with the plebeian ass commons. Oh, I'm so happy. We have a dark contract with the entities as a ultra. Ring. All right, I just want to get through the rest of these now. <laughs> a fusion enforcer uh, video is almost done uploading. She number peacock delta. All right, we have a few more packs here. Five more after this one. Still need a few ultra rares, I believe. Subterra Cave Clash. Yeah, I think the only way this box can get better if we pulled in like a Thoroughblade. Well, she's not even that expensive. Maybe a couple of the Wind Witches still. I think we're still missing one or two uh, Ultras. So. We'll see. Alright, this is pack four, three left after this. Formal Cloud Dag Daggerman. He actually seemed pretty hard to find too. Out of five boxes, I pulled one of him uh, last night, so that's pretty nuts. 
I don't know if he's any good or not. I haven't really read him. I need to go through all the cards and read them, but uh, yeah. See that wrap here? One difference between uh, American and European cards, though, is um, the ink is slightly different, I've noticed. Because um, when the Destiny Soldiers came out or whatever, I noticed I had like different colored cards between those two. Uh, the American ones I ordered online and the uh, the British ones I ordered in person. Alright, I, I, I feel like there should be one more ultra rare, but we'll see. But yeah, like, I forget which one. One of them is a darker ink and the other one's lighter. Like, one of the cards, it was, um, it was like a bluish shade and the other version was like pink. Alright, so I guess we got all of our ultra rares. Alright, so that was a dope ass box. Um, Thanks a, got, a lot for your, uh, joining me for this opening, guys. Hopefully you enjoyed it. Uh, I think this is a really successful box for the second one. I wish my other ones were as good as this one, but, I mean, it's fine. We got we got a lot of what we needed. So, yeah, thanks a lot for joining me. Look out for more videos in the future, and uh, like, subscribe if you want. Just tell your friends about this channel. Yeah, um, Yeah. so I'll see you in the future, guys. Later.